And now... All three players in pretty good shape. Heather goes first once again in double jeopardy. Here are the categories. Big roadies. Oops. Physics. The 700 Club. Common pounds. All five vowels in one word. Each correct response. And the all writers basketball team. Up you go. Champ, five start. Five in one word, please. For four. It's a conversation between two people. Or the talky part of movies. Catherine. Catherine. Dialogue. That's it. 800 five vowels. To give a person official power to do something. Catherine. Catherine. What is authorized? That's the word. Yes. 1,200 five vowels. You'd do well to learn about this cabinet department. Catherine. Catherine. What is education? Yes. That's the word. 1,500 five vowels. This veggie describes an ear deformed by repeated injury. Christian? What is a cauliflower? Yes. That's the word. Try 700 club for 400. In the Dewey Decimal System, books filed under the 720s cover this subject, including buildings and public structures. Catherine. What is architecture? Correct. 2,005 vowels. You qualify as this if your bank balance has a two followed by six zeros. Catherine? What is a double millionaire? No. Heather? What is a multimillionaire? That's the word, yes. That's the word. Uh, common ponds for 400. Michigan and Ohio share this great lake. Christian? What is Lake Erie? Correct. Common ponds for 800. Like the bigger Lake Titicaca, Lake Sushis is on the border of Peru and this southern neighbor. Christian? What is Chile? No. No. Catherine. What is Bolivia? That's the southern That's neighbor. the word. Common ponds, 1,200. Manitoba shares Reindeer Lake with this neighbor to the west. Catherine? What is Alberta? No. That's right. Christian. No. What is Saskatchewan? That's the province. That's Common the word. Common ponds for 1,600. Answer there. Answer there. You are still in the lead. I'll wager 600. Okay. All right. Here is the clue if you get it right. Germany, Switzerland, and this neighbor share the Bondinsee, a.k.a. Lake Constance. Uh, what is Austria? That's the country. Yes, That's indeed. the right place. Select again. Common ponds for 2,000. Burundi, the Democratic Republic of the Congo, Zambia, and Tanzania have this long lake in common. Catherine. Catherine. What is Lake Tanganyika? That's it. That's right. 700 Club 800. Take a big gulp before telling us that gulp. DCCXI is this year in Roman numerals. Catherine. What is 711? Say, yeah. 1200 700 Club. Hank Aaron <laughs> ended his career with this record number of regular season home runs. Anybody? Catherine? What is 746? No. No. Christian or Heather? Anyone? Oh my oh, God. 55. Go again, Catherine. 700, 1600. Its <clears throat> cube root is nine. Anyone? Oh. Nine times nine is 81. 81 times nine is 729. Catherine. 2000. And and Catherine 702 and 775 are area codes in this state. Anybody? Come on. California's neighbor, Nevada. Catherine, let's go somewhere else. All right, the All Riders basketball team for 400. Six foot four from the University of Maine, this dead zone author. Catherine. Catherine. Who's Stephen King? Correct. 800 writers. Six nine from Harvard, this man who wrote thrillers under the name John Lange. Lange is tall in German. And Heather? Heather. Sorry. Oh, drawing a blank. That'll cost you. Catherine or Christian? Oh, oh no. Catherine, we come back to you. Big Roadies 400. In 1993, bass tech Stuart Morgan played a gig for this Irish band when Adam Clayton couldn't make it. Okay, Christian. Christian. Who is U2? Yes. Big Roadies for 800. Shock G of Digital Underground said, of all the roadies we ever had, this rapper killed in Vegas in 96 was the best. Catherine. Who is Tupac? Yes. 1,200 writers. Six foot six inches from the Repton School in Derbyshire. This children's author seen with wife Patricia Neal. Anybody? And the author's name is Donald <sighs> Dahl. 
Catherine. 1,600 writers. Six foot three from Fairfax High. This author of crime books like L.A. Confidential. Christian. Who is John Grisham? No. Heather? No. Who is Elmo Leonard? No. Catherine. Catherine. Is Jan? No. Jane. Who is Jane? Oh, Elmo no. <laughs> but we come back to you, Catherine. 2,000. Six feet eight inches from Ontario Agricultural College. This economist who wrote The New Industrial State. Anybody? And his name was John Ugh. Kenneth Galbraith. All right, two categories, one and a half categories still in play. Catherine. Physics for 400. It's the property of some unstable atoms that causes them to give off ionizing radiation. Anyone? What is radioactivity? Oh, man. 800. This branch of physics <laughs> deals with the structure and nature of cosmic bodies. Catherine? What is cosmology? Cosmology or astrophysics? Yes, with a minute to go. 1200 for physics. Condensed matter physics deals with superfluidity in which certain liquids flow without this. <laughs> Catherine. Captain. Friction? Friction is right. 1600 physics. The smallest discrete amount of radiant energy is called this. Also a name for a branch of physics. Christian. Christian. What is a particle? No. Catherine or Heather? What is quantum physics? Catherine, you pick. 2000 physics. Answer. The other daily double. You have a $2,000 lead. And we're running out of time. Um, I'll wager 1000 Okay, here is the clue. Jimmy, help us. Use the clue if you get it right. You can see the arrows are pointing in the same way, right? Well, watch what happens when water is added, and this direction-changing physics property takes place. What is reflection? No, you're close. No, that's reflection, not right. Not reflection. So you now enjoy a $1,000 lead. The game is closer. We're coming into final jeopardy. Here is the category for the three of you. English, English monarch. Monarch. Think about that. Make your wagers. Clue coming up.